So hey guys, we are back with another new video and in this video we are gonna be showing you the best custom ROM for the Xiaomi Redmi Note 4 and Redmi Note 3. This is the best ROM that I have found so far. It works very smoothly on both the devices. And the most important thing is that it is a stable ROM. It does not have any bugs or at least I have not noticed any. So without any further ado, let's jump right into the video. So as I previously said, this is a stable ROM and it works very smoothly on my device. I have been using it for the last few months and it still works very nicely. I have loaded tons of apps in it and still doesn't see any lag. It has a very simple use of it that is very easy to use. You can also use split screen mode very smoothly. The apps don't seem to lag much or at least they don't even. They work very smoothly as you can see here. This ROM is very light and is a boon for the multitaskers like me. The name of this ROM is Pixel Experience ROM and as the name suggests, this ROM gives you the experience of the Pixel devices on your Android phone. Just download this ROM, flash it using PWRP and boom, you have the Pixel experience on your phone without even buying it. This ROM comes loaded with Android 8.1 Oreo which is the latest OS for Android devices right now in the market. It also comes with a unique Easter egg and personally I love to pass my time playing with this octopus and my younger brother can spend even hours playing with it. I just love how smoothly everything works in this ROM. From texting someone to playing GTA San Andreas, everything works very smoothly in this device. And what's more is that it even has Volte support, so now stop suffering with those old ROMs which had Volte issues. This ROM has everything fixed for you. Another useful feature of this ROM is the face unlock feature. As you can see, I am gonna lock my phone. And you can see that all my fingers are in front and I am not gonna touch that fingerprint scanner. Now just wake up your phone, look at the lens and voila, it would be unlocked. It's as easy as that. Let's try it one more time. And as you can see it is unlocked. It's very fast, reliable and very effective. Now moving on, let's talk about its battery. This ROM can give you on an average about 12 to 13 hours of battery life on normal usage. So overall this is a great ROM for both heavy and casual users. It is very fast, effective, packed with a lot of features and also is not too heavy. The size of this ROM is below 800 MB. Also note that installing this ROM is a little bit different from the rest. So keep watching the video till the end so that you don't make any mistakes while installing this super ROM. Now in order to install this ROM, you must have TWRP recovery installed. Now download the zip file of the ROM from the link in the description box below. I recommend you to store the zip file in your external SD card. After that, just turn off your mobile phone. Now you need to boot into TWRP recovery and to do that, just press and hold the volume up button with the power button. You will have to keep them pressed until your phone boots up. Now as you can see here, my phone has started booting up. Now wait until the TWRP recovery screen appears. Now as you can see, we have booted up into TWRP recovery and as you can see, I am using the version 3.2.1-0 which is the latest so far. Now allow it to completely load up. Now follow all the steps carefully because this is very important. Now tap on wipe, select advanced wipe and select the following options. 
Delvic Art Cache, System, Data and Cache. After that, just swipe to wipe them. Note that this will wipe all the data on your phone, so it's recommended to take a backup of it. I would recommend you all to use Titanium Backup Pro. It can take a complete backup of all the data on your phone. You can download that app from the link in the description box below. After that, just swipe to wipe all the data. Now what you need to do is, just tap on install and search for the zip file that you have downloaded earlier. Just tap on it and just swipe to confirm flash in order to install that ROM onto your device. It might take a few moments in order to install it. So as you can see here, it has finished flashing. Now just tap on wipe cache and delve it and just swipe to confirm it. Now once it is done, tap on reboot system and you are done. You have successfully installed your custom ROM onto your device. Enjoy! So thanks for watching guys, hope that you liked it. If you did so, smash that like button under this video and consider subscribing to our channel in order to motivate me to make new videos like this. And if you have any feedback or suggestions or have any questions about this video, you can comment to me in the comment section below and I will reply to you as soon as possible. So see you guys in the next video. Till then, bye bye.